Cooking Vicky here with you and I wanted to do the flip through of my recipe book so this is what it turned out looking like it's very chunky the uh, I cleaned up the the, um, the book cover but it was still grungy which I love that is grungy but at the same time because it's a cookbook I wanted it to be uh, clean and not to get dirty um, you know to mess up my hands when I'm using it and end up um, you know contaminating whatever so I decoupage on it so that it's varnished and uh, now the, the whatever was on it won't, won't rub off um, so that's what it's looking like uh, so that book is a monster of a book it's actually 10 inches by seven inches and it ended up being almost three inches thick obviously i always do too many signatures i always think i'm gonna have um not enough and then obviously with all the pockets and the recipes put in it becomes very thick so i realized fast enough that two signatures would be plenty and uh, thank god i did that because you can see that it's 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 really really thick um, so let me do a flip through so I left the the page uh, I thought it was great and I left this because it had somebody's writing on it and I thought that was amazing then I used some seri fabric to cover the the, the space between the spine and um, and the the page so I've numbered all the pages and because it's all pockets and that my recipes are tucked in, I've put in this index and I'm going to finish doing it uh, as, I, um, as I go through it. Uh, I've cut down the recipes that I could so that it wouldn't make it as thick, um, but that's about as much as I can, I can cut. Uh, so I'll be finishing this off as I... Um, watch TV I've also put if it was a recipe that came from my mother-in-law or my mom or my dad or my uh, grandmother uh, who it came from because I figured this might be a book well I'm hoping that this is going to be a book that the kids uh, can can keep afterwards and uh, of our favorite recipes and so it'd be kind of nice to know who the recipe was from um, because it's also on index cards like this if uh, for one a reason or another there's a recipe that we don't like anymore we can always remove it and uh, I can always white it out and put another recipe in so here we go here's a flip through so the recipes are not in order um, it's whatever so you can see that some are pretty old the the papers have been um, you know brought out and 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 on and so forth um, but I think that kind of makes it fun that it's whatever paper it was written on like this one is quite old it was from my grandma's uh, my grandma's recipe so I've had it for quite a long time and here I kept this because the recipe is on the lid and I thought that was kind of fun so I think my pockets turned out really good I'm quite happy with it and uh, the recipes, I either folded them in three or folded them in two. It, depended, it depends on the, um, the recipe. And I usually put the date that I've done it um, and what we thought about it the first time I did it. So this is from a magazine. So you can see it's quite eclectic. There's a lot of recipes that are printed out. This was from, uh, this is a soup recipe and it was from the package. So I had removed it and put it on a piece of paper to keep it. I'm quite happy with uh, how I finished off all the uh, the envelopes and I used up a lot of envelopes this dates from 20 years ago over 20 years ago I had uh, cut out this from uh, a packaging so some of those recipes that we've had for quite a long time this is an actual um, business card that I thought fitted with this so there's 64 pages in total and I've only got these left to fill out so I'll I will pr most probably um, make another one eventually 
but I'm happy I think it looks really yummy and um, it's gonna be a good addition in my kitchen so looking forward to reading your comments about this I hope uh, it inspires you to make your own I think it's a great um, thing to pass on to the future generations because computer files and stuff like that um, I'm not sure will make it through time whereas books have uh, and it's kind of nice to see people's handwriting and uh, that's what I'm hoping to pass on to my kids so uh, that is it for now bye everyone